Hi guys, and um, if you clicked on this, I've been waiting for this for about, let's say, six years at this point. I think it's a fair assumption. Uh, at this point, actually seven. And it's something that I've been hinting at, but I've never actually said openly. I got this box a while ago, and um, it's probably been two weeks at this point since I received it. Um, I wasn't able to make the video right away, but I still want to make it, even though I know what's in the box and I've seen it. Uh, and let's, it's, it's pretty darn cool. There's already kind of a hint here what it is, and I'm sure if you, if you notice a difference, you'll, you know what's going to happen. But um, for the longest time, I, I started the channel off with obviously my main set of goggles, right? And uh, those goggles were um, ones that I grabbed because it was sentimental. It was um, really symbolic, and that's why I wore them. But they're just cheap Halloween co uh, costume ones. Then I got these other ones that were actually given to me by my mom. That was sometime during my uh, 13th, 14th birthday. I think it was 13th. I'm pretty sure it was 13th birthday. And uh, they were awesome. They were like actual like, metal, nice goggles that were authentic and uh, handmade. You know, they weren't just cheap, process, manufactured bullshit. So um, I am I enjoyed those. And even though they fell apart a lot because they're old, and even the uh, wrapping behind it, you know, that held my uh, the band that held my held it to my head, even though it kept rotting, kind of like breaking. Um, I still loved it, and I still do. I think it's probably one of the most aesthetic looking ones. But that's just it. It's aesthetic, and it means a lot to me. But it also kept breaking. Um, it kept falling apart, and, um, that's all I can really say, it was, it was old, it was old, so, um, here we are, though, and one thing I've always wanted is I never wanted to get another pair of goggles unless it was actually sent to me, I wanted them to be authentic, and I wanted them to always have that feeling where, um, I didn't have to make my own or get another pair, I wanted them to always feel like there was a sense of specialty behind them, because that's why I wear them, that's the whole purpose, if not, then, like, why am I... I, well, I just want to wear them for to feel feel cool. I mean, fuck that. You know, I, I want to actually wear it and feel some pride behind it, and that's why um this uh next set is uh very important. So um <sighs> these things are so damn cool. Let me let me, let me put it on. The only thing that's a little bad is that this just back end that's heavy. But um, you guys might not even know what this is right away. Let me uh slap this bad boy on. Oh yeah. So Whew. there we go. These are the new goggles. They're actually sent to me by my good friend Orange and um there's some more packaging and uh I don't know where it went. That's that's the only sad thing. I, I had this for a while and dude, the I think packaging is downstairs. My mom maybe threw it away or something, maybe. Um but I had the box and that's all that really matters. And um within it, uh I also have the other important stuff and one of them was that this little message and it's very simple, but um, I'm going to just go and put it up here. Basically, it says to Joshua G, the blue OG from Matthew S. Orange is the best. XOXO. -X -O. Hope you love these, man. And uh, in response to that. So, yeah, thank you, Orange. Um, you know, it means a lot. And um, all I can say, and here's the cool thing about it, is uh, first off, let's finish up talking about the goggles. These are really damn cool. Um, the, the, they kind of look goofy here, and that's why the, that's the only reason I might be a little skeptical of how people think about them. Because I mean, they have it looks like there's googly eyes, really, if you just look at it straight on. And the nice thing, uh, well, okay, let me let me say this, but but the reason why it's there, the reason why it's like that, is because if I plug this thing in, ow, there we go, look at that. Qu quite literally, they light up. Hold on, ah, I plugged it in for some reason, my hair got caught in it. But the cool thing about it too is that you can plug it in, right? And it changes colors. Now, am I going to do that? Um, no, because it's just LED, and it'll turn on everything else in this room, which I do not want to mess with. But here's the cool thing, and here's why it's really awesome. So first off, these are super iconic now because I mean, like, I can actually just be blue digit and be like, yeah, my things light up. You know, it's just like I can be, I can be anime as fucking real life, man. But here's the second thing. Here's the second thing that I think is super damn cool, right? Um, I can actually wear these, and they'll stay in my head. I know that sounds really dumb, but like the last pair, like I could not wear. Like, like these are staying up there, and that's how I usually wear them. But like, if someone wants to see me wear them, I should be able to, and I haven't been able to. Those ones, the, literally, the band was getting so bad that, that like the band on my headphones, I would put them on, and I would squeeze my head set so tight on so that the band, the, it would hold back the band, like this, let's say. And even though it wouldn't stay in my head all the way, it would, it would just hold it there, and I'd be yeah. Long story short, yeah. So these. I can fucking wear, and the cool thing is too, I I can see out of these two. I mean, I I can I can I can see you. So 
I mean, it's pretty cool. I, I think so, at least. So, um, that's, that's that. <laughs> but, um, and just in case you don't believe me, here's the, here's the little remote that it goes with. Um, it even has a little thing for it. But, um, here's the spiel, and this is why it's really important. Um, I remember Orange telling me for Christmas you'd get me a present like this. And he actually got my girlfriend, Tasia one, too. Uh, it was really awesome. He got her, like, a little, like, mug for, uh, her game. So, yeah. But, the cool thing is that... This is, it's kind of a roundabout thing, and it sounds kind of silly. I, I am going to rant here. This is going to be a, a little bit of a rant, but the thing is, like, I, I've been friends with this guy ever since 2016, one of my best friends ever, and even though we don't talk all the time, um, our friendship has always been very strong, and the one thing I've always been um, grateful for is his generosity and always just being there for me, even though I'm sure things are going hard in his life. He's got his own issues going on, and uh, nonetheless, he always shows me positivity, and he, he's almost there for me as, as almost like a big brother figure. I mean, I've always been very uh, thankful for that. And it, it goes just to prove, in my opinion, that um, even though this is someone that, you know, I've met online and, you know, lives miles upon miles away, um, this doesn't mean this is a fake relationship. Like, it doesn't mean that this is just, you know, oh, well, he's just an online friend. I mean, I've spoken to these people more than people I've I've sat literally feet across in school. I mean, and, and I still talk to these people more than that and have deeper connections. And I don't believe it's just that. I think it's a, it's a much tighter thing. Um, and maybe it's also because I believe that because I'm, I'm a man of faith. But I mean, this is something that I'm very blessed and grateful to have. And um, I mean, I'll be frank, you know, there's a lot of times where, you know, I'll sit here and be like, should I keep doing YouTube? Should I keep making videos? And I, you know, I still have those thoughts. But the biggest thing, um, and the reason why I don't quit is because of, Moments like this. I believe it's arrogant and foolish to believe that you know exactly how the future is going to go. And I, I always thought back on the on the good old days of, you know, when I used to, you know, hear from my friends like him, you know, Orange, and talk to him. And, uh, you know, actually, yeah, I'm already sending stuff in the mail. And I always thought back, I'm like, ah, oh, man, that was a good time. And the, and the fact that I was able to indulge in this again, and if not to a better extent, because I have so much more, and I, it just, it makes you blessed, and it really just shows you how there's so much to life and how, how you can't just um, take for granted nor believe that you know it all. So I'm just really grateful for him. And Orange, if you're watching this, thank you for um, getting me here and um, we'll make it this far. All right, well, as for everyone else, here's the little, uh, here's the box. Here's the, okay, hold on. Let, let's see if we can make a little thumbnail really quick. I, can, can I do a thumbnail? Ugh. Let's see if I can plug this puppy in and be like. <laughs> but um, love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm going to be trying my best to do some more videos on the uh, Twitch, so check that out. And also make sure to uh, check out the next videos coming out right after this one, because it's going to be, surprisingly enough, on Mando.com. So, love you guys. Smile. Keep it right up. And uh, as always, let's fight for your future to break. Just make sure My name is Bodhisattva, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye, guys. Whoop!